for the encouragement of, under the leadership of Pastor uh, Manny Hardiniano for joining all to the force of the whole district. We really appreciate it and God bless you more in your uh, ministry. I don't have the, the video because I'm crying all the time, but anyway, thank you very much. Thank you, Brother Ariel.
as you always, wanna, I always remember. You want to turn on your visions from the Marestelas? So welcome, Ati Velma. Yeah, I I uh, I saw Inday last night. Uh huh. I saw LG. Mm. I saw everyone, but I just couldn't get the Zoom number. But tonight mm -hmm. I was able to. Well, anyway, how how do you put the picture of me? <laughs> California. Yes. Yeah. And uh, see everyone. Mm -hmm. But then after Mama Belin passed away, mm. I uh, I didn't have the chance to go back there. But every year I used to go there. You know that. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And dance. And here, of course, Raquel. Mm -hmm. I miss Raquel. Oh, well. Such is life, you know, one has to go ahead and one at a time. It's just a borrowed life anyway. Well, all right, uh, I have to leave now. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Atevilma. Okay. Okay, Primo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good night. Oh, good night. Good best. Okay. How about Mom Annie? I think she wants to say something last night. Omani, are you okay? <laughs> you can't. Well, at Philippine Union College, there were two classes for the fourth year. And uh, Amy, because uh, they go by last names. <clears throat> and mine is letter A for Alvarez. So I was with the other group, and Annie is in the uh, the other group with the one who spoke earlier. That's Tita, Tita Rose Villanueva. Oh, Tita! Wow. Okay. Hey, Tita, you're still on. Okay. There's an echo. Anyway, so she was in the other class. So we would meet each other on the hallway and um, we would see her when, whenever we have programs or when we were at the chapel because we have this uh, chapel period every Friday morning and we would see her there. She is one of the most quiet classmates that I have ever had. She's got a smiling face, but that's about it. If you ask her something, she's going to answer you. And uh, it's so hard to, you know, like uh, make her talk. But I guess you have to, to know her so she could open up to you. But she's uh, a, very, a very, very nice person. And very pretty too. Of course. You know? <laughs> she is, mm -hmm. yeah. And um, she's also, a very smart lady and um, it was so sad that um, like what uh, Tita said earlier we're trying to find uh, classmates here in the States and also in the Philippines but when it is a lady that you are looking for it would be much harder to find that person because they don't carry their last names anymore like what we knew, how we knew them in high school. They carry the last name of their husbands. So even mm. up to now, we have not heard from some Anybody? of Yes. And um, it's uh, easier to find classmates in the U.S. because there are so many sources from where you can get their names and their you know, addresses, email, and all that, but uh, not in the Philippines. And uh, it was hard to find her because I was looking for her as Amy Villaruel, not Amy Legaspi. So um, if only we had known that she was in the U.S. after she finished her residency in at Manila Sanitarium, 
we could have gotten in touch with her. So it's very unfortunate that we would hear about her, hear from Epi and the sister, but it's only we're getting to know her through you all. So thank you so much. We have learned more about Amy in the last two days that I've been uh, a part of this memorial. And uh, if we're gonna have another memorial tomorrow, as well as on Friday, I will try my best to be here also. So thank you, thank you all. It's nice meeting you. Even yes, that is true. Jesus is about to come. That's what he told me. And I really praise the Lord for that. Mm -hmm. Our last conversation. I was calling her. Um, you know, the computer is upstairs or maybe. She, so she called me back and we had a, about 30 minutes conversation talking mm -hmm. about God and the situation in the Philippines. And she was insisting to, to get the document here, uh, power of attorney from, what's that? Any embassy. embassy. Yeah, to do to some uh, legal papers for the property. But so that's the main thing. Mm -hmm. And I was so shocked. I was, after my birthday celebration last Saturday evening, as what Brother Ariel mentioned earlier. Right, right. Uh -huh. it's just, That's it, yeah, it just happened. Brother Ariel was there, and Brother Mark. Mm -hmm. I, 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 and at that time, I was talking to Norman, our nephew, and nephews, Norman and Malcolm, and Banji, the wife of Malcolm. We were talking about the time, about six something to seven, and then ten o'clock when we are about to, to go home. There's we still, stay there for a while talking. You know. We, we friends, it's like family from the heart. We don't want to separate from each other. And I received a call from Eugene. And boy was there, our cousin and big. I thought he was just, he just got, she just got accident and fell off, lying on bed. Uh -huh. So finally I asked, what is happening? Where, where is she? Is she in the hospital or where is she? And then boy told me that boy and Beck, Rebecca, one of our sisters, she said, Ami is gone. Oh. That's it. Once she's gone, you will be able to talk to her again until you know. But but thank God for the God, you know. So we, we still have our reunion when Jesus comes. But mm -hmm. at this moment, you know, we feel the 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 grief and and pain, but yet yeah, that's normal. Everybody, everybody has that experience. That's why we really appreciate even even Sylvia. Sylvia Costa, one of our cousins here. Terry died with COVID. And it's terrible. We were not able to go there. We cannot go out. Uh, uh, Prima uh, Sylvia, uh, we uh, are extending our condolences. Thank you. You know. Thank you. I'm yes. offering also my yes. prayers mm -hmm. and my sincerest condolences to Miriam, Rebecca, yes. David. Um, it's uh, it's so sad. Yeah. You know what happened? It's one after the other. With frankly, yeah. it's just too shocking. Yeah, at least Franklin, we were able to go with Norman. Mm -hmm. I think, yeah, I think. Uh, yeah. yeah, Paris, Paris was just. Uh, Paris, death four was days. so shocking to four us. Days. And, yeah. Every time he went to the hospital, it only lasted four days. I didn't even see him. So, but well, every, all of us are gonna go, but I, I just don't know where, when, our time will come. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, we God's just have program, to be. It's not just that, have to be ready. Yeah. So that when even our time, at least we're ready for to meet everybody and at the resurrection morning. Right. Yeah. God's design for That's, us is to live with Him. But yes. sin entered, death came, but thank God that the, the death that we are experiencing now is just temporary. Everything yes. in this world is temporary. It's temporary only. The only thing that is permanent is when Jesus comes, all of us will be with him. Yes. And we will, 
we will all have the time, not a virtual, but Eternity. spiritual fellowship already. <laughs> Praise the Lord for this truth. Yeah. Yes, yeah. now uh, just enjoy life. Yes, yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. Enjoy it to the fullest. Mm -hmm. Time is short. Also, we should spend time with Jesus also, so that we will see mm -hmm. Ami again. <laughs> Yeah. We really appreciate Pastor Hardiniano, we are Piper, Brother Ariel for joining us. It's such a blessing. The whole district is in full support, full blast. And tomorrow oh. will be uh, two, districts. two districts, one from Cavite, seven churches, and three churches here from New York. So if you want to join, oh. you can join. Uh, I may have a question. Yes. So, so on the last day, which will be Friday night, where you be, who, is somebody going? To... You know, just in case these things will happen to us, we are always we are now in the hands of the Lord through yeah. the gospel message. That's and true. by this time, we need to express our love, our our concern with each other. <laughs> family, blood, blood family, and spiritual family is the same. You know, mm -hmm. we love we love one another as God loved us in Jesus Christ. Hi. Thank you everybody for your support to our family. I was in Masabati when we were locked down and we stayed there for three and a half months before we came back here in California. We always go to Ami's place every afternoon, bring her some food and we eat with her so that she will have a companion. And she always uh, have a hard time breathing. But I ask her, you want to go to Manila? But she said, but there's no uh, transportation going there. So we were not able to uh, make her go to Manila to check up. So um, we were lucky that there's there one one time like june june 20 we were able to come to manila but the uh, uh the roro and uh through beacon with the uh, uh one we on me and my family like my husband my daughter my son-in-law and my grandson Five of us, five of us were able to go to Manila and then we went like two days stay in Manila and then we had a flight uh, Philippine Airlines so we were able to be back in California. So I can I was even surprised that she had a heart attack. I thought it's another disease she has, like lung disease or something like that. But I think it's in our family that uh, we have um, genes like my father died of a heart attack too, and his brothers. So. Maybe Ami got that, and maybe we also got that. So uh, my my family and my um, grandchildren and my uh, son and daughter and my husband, thank you for everything. Thank you very much. That's it.
Hyundai. <laughs> si Hyundai Mercury. <laughs> Hyundai gusto mo mag-istorya, Hyundai? <laughs> si Boy, ada si Boy? Tagalog, Tagalog. Tagalog? Or mas bate nyo? Maparam na ko. Condolences, ha? Salamat po, Silvia, ha? Oo, condolences, ha? Salamat, salamat. I'm so sorry. So sad. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Hi, Dylan. Dylan, how are you? Hi, Dylan. Oh, no, no. No, wait, wait, wait. wait. Say something. Say something. Say something. Say something. Say Hi. Hi. What's your name? Oh, you're Dylan. What's your name? Dylan. Dylan Barlow. Wow. Can you dance? Let me see your dance. Yeah. How's your dance? Yeah. Your dance. Oh. <laughs> you're inviting, you're pulling Lola Prime's hand to dance together. <laughs> Si Ate Ami, dili man gayod ako as in direct na family member kay ang husband ko man gayod ang kasi ni Ate Ami pero si Ate Ami bagan sister ko na manggad si Ate Ami kay all the time na kun ano niya problema magsabalay niya magsa um personal niya na life naga Nagasabi gagad si Ate Ami, nagakadi siya sa akon. Nare-remember ko na 2 o'clock p.m. makadi siya sa akon. Halayo pa, nagaada pa lang sa doors and store ko. Masiyak na siya. Mercury, nanon merienda ta. Ay, Ate Ami, <laughs> mapaluto na lang kita. Masabi siya, paduyan gusto ko. Maluton helper. Naingkod siya didi sa side ko. Dugay-dugay naga uli. Dili ko man siya masabi na, Ate Ami, inan damo-damo akong trabaho sa tindahan. Kaya bagan, nabibisi ako nag-computer, kaya may nagabaya, nagabayad sa store. Sige, sige lang yan. Istorya, tawa-tawa. Pero si Ate Ami, bagan, dili ako maka-expect na irog sa ito nangyari sa iya kay uh, Thursday, nagtawag pa siya sa ako, nagsabi sa Mercury. Mm, may trabahan pi ka kay an akon usad na units an apartment nagleak an mga pipings sabi ko sige po ate ami kay pag si ate ami nagatawag sa amon dili kami ami nang ginasabi ko gani kan ate dabit na dili kami makasino no always yes pag si ate ami na an naga naga request kan boy uh, Last na na-remember ko sa iya, 3 o'clock, 3, 3 o'clock EM, nag-call siya. Sabi ko, kamboy, Daddy, magbangon ka kay, nag-call si Ate Ami, siguro mga one week ago. Sabi ni Boy, ay sige lang, nga na nanaaga, kay, piraw-piraw ako. Sabi ko, no, kay, aram mo na may sakit si Ate Ami. Basi sabi ko, dili na matawag, kung dili, emergency ba? Kaya, Napiritan si Boy mag mag-answer sa niya phone tapos nagsabi siya sin Boy kadi anay kami kay an amon balay grabin baho san gasolina dili na ako nakahangus sabi ko okay ta ah. sabi ko na sa imo na dili na matawag kun dili emergency kay sabi ko always 12 my 12 may irog sana matawag siya pag wala siyang medicine dili siya nakabakal matawag siya sin Boy hanapi akong bulong Ay, hanap si Boy. Kaya sabi ko, masakit ba sa part namun na wala nang marisita din sa amon kung may mga sakit. Kaya sabi ko, uh, bagan sister, gan sa amon si Ate Ami, ginakansyawang ko siya na Ate Ami, nag-retire ka na pagka-doktor niya, na engineer ka naman. 
kay bright talaga si Ate Ami. Grabe siya sa computation. Pag ma, ano siya, masabi siya sa akin, Mercury, amulay ni baka lang need ko. Amo man lang gadi na, na baka lang tinanglan sa niya building. Kaya sabi ko, grabe si Ate Ami, kaburo bright. Sabi ko, engineer ka naman yan, dili ka na doktor. Nagatawa lang gadi na siya kag si Ate Ami ang tao na kung na nun imo isabi sa iya, dili siya ma-answer sa imo sa negative din sa ito na tao na imo gin istorya sa iya. Ang permi lang niya ginasabat sa akon is, pabayay lang Mercury, makarealize man sinda when time will come na wara ka man sa inda nagalabot. Kaya sabi ko gani, thankful ako na si Ate Ami naging part sa buhay na mo ni Boy na ginakomfort yan ako niya permi ko na nun akon mga problema. Kaya baga, sister ko na din si Ate Ami. Amo lang po inan masabi ko kay magdili ko na kaya mag magsabi pa sa mga nangyari dat ano Sunday kay bagan kasakit-sakit gyud kita una nakahapa si Ate Ami na dili mo maintindihan ko na nun mga reaction sa tao that time na gin ka istorya mo pa lang Thursday tapos bigla pagka Sunday wara na Amo lang po thank you Thank you Inday ha Really appreciate it Ibaan may message na hali kayo dida. Pero um, si Boy, masunod naman si Boy kung ada. Anyway, so... Sa Friday na daw siya. Friday na daw siya. Yeah. Salamat na igaw kita two services, day and night. Very comforting manina kung ada sinda back dida, kag sinda bogs, si Edwin, mga bata. Gusto ko kung tani, uh, gusto ko mm. sana doon para hindi sila naka tingala lagi dito sa sa iPad kung may TV monitor sana at uh, tawag nito the projector the, uh, I think they gonna have the projector M bagan mas setting man sinda impabulig naman ni Boy Sir Richard na mas setting ata kinimbalsaman Siguro ma-absent ako sa Friday para makamati ako sa ceremony primo. Game. Wala na si Lucille. Si Michelle. Oh, pero hasta natapos. Hasta, na, hasta oh, natapos oh. ang service. Wala pero nakita ko ang aran mo kagabi. Nakita Kasi ko. Ito na nga, alas 4 yung medyan maaga, nag-sign in ako. Inanak sa ikaw. Pag si ikaw gali ang pinakadugi. At abatag pa ako. Oo. Oh. Alas siya yung media palang dida sa iyo, nag-sign in na ako. Tapos usad-usad, usad-usad may nag-gabtukan ng ami. At si Serge. Serge, kumusta? Wala na si Ate Ami. Kondolin sa inyo lahat dyan. Mag-umingaw. Ayan ay boy, kaysa yan sa ikaw. Tadi wala pang tao. Yung para patugtog ang antiano ni Ephraim, yung para pakita ang picture ni Ami. Gin para ni nga wako ko namin ug para tinangi sa kung nga maaga. Ay, um, ang, ang mga picture ni Ami, ang tugtog ni Prime man in in tugtog. Uh, ang background sa kay matura uh, ano ni ano. Namingaw gyud ako ko namin ug para tinangi sa kung nga maaga. Tapos inan sige ko papati asa na nag-abot na ang 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 service ang pastor. Kaya natapos ko ito. Tapos yun, matahong man yung deservice. Ano, pati mga kanta ni Ingram, ang ganda. Kasi sinahanap ko sa muna may curie. Wala ko man kung makita ang dayon. Pero sa dugay na, makita ito na ikaw, nagtulakad ko ka na. Tapos si Bog, sabi ko, dili, nagtulakad ko si Bog sa kami.